Hey everybody, it's me, Shelby. This is my first video, so bear with me. <laughs> um, so today I'm going to be doing a quick and easy makeup look. I'm fixing to go to the movies actually with my boyfriend and I'm seeing Tarzan. But quick, easy, just highlight, a little bit of brow bronzer and blush and then some mascara. So let's get into it. So the first thing that I'm going to do take my Hoola contour bronzing powder from Benefits and do that with just a little bitty brush that's inside. It's so cute to hold it, but I think it fits perfectly just right through here and I kind of turn it in and Cheekbones that I'm making here. Bring this out. I can't see too well on this side because of the sun. darker and my summer job at the summer it's outside of the garden center so um, I just pretty much I won't play it all day so I'm actually kind of playing it already well for myself I'm like already so <laughs> I'm pretty dark for for me at least so I'm gonna kind of bring this into the hairline so that my hairline looks the same way it does on my head Kind of putting it with some natural tip into my temple, kind of along my hairline. Just kind of put a little bit right here with my eyes and my nose. Kind of do a little bit in the ears. Yeah. So feeling somewhat traumatic about what I need to do. I take this brush. Kind of, it's kind of small. It is kind of small, but it's it's fat. So I'm gonna barely tap it into the into the bronzer and kind of tap it off a little bit, and then I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna just just contour it just a little bit right here, right here. So I'm gonna take my is done. Sometimes I bring it down on my neck, whatever's left on there, and I'll kind of bring it down just a little bit. Fix the jawline just a little bit with my finger. A lot of girls don't like that because it's kind of like masking, but I think it looks fine. I think it's the jawline for cool. Okay, I'm done. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this Luxie Luxie 522 Tapered Highlighter Brush and get a little bit of number 5 Accentuate in the Tardiest Tardiest Contour Palette. So let's see if I can get my sweetness out a little too. Kind of bring it up right here just a little bit more, um, just to 
kind of, I think that's where the sun's going to hit, so we're going to get there. That's what it's going to feel like. Get some sun. I don't want it to be too close, but I want it to be on the this back so that it's like almost here. Oh, okay. Uh, I think maybe she needs to go like here. Yeah, she needs to go here. Kind of do a windshield wiping motion. I kind of swirl it a little bit. Um, whatever you feel like. I mean, it's you and your makeup. You do what you want. Um, so, I mean, I do lots of different styles. I'm so weird. Probably I'll do like a really simple look like this most of the time. And then yesterday from church, I had a kind of dramatic look. It was, I loved it. Like, I loved the different style, I guess you could say, of, like, my makeup or whatever. I'm really sorry about that noise, if you can hear it. My brother and my dad are mowing right now, so I don't know what they're doing, but they're mowing, so. And my makeup is behind me. There we go. Okay, so now it's a highlighter. Um, this is... That Glow Though by Trust Fund Beauty. It's uh, in this little container. It kind of looks like lipstick. When I first got it in my empty bag, it looked like lipstick. I was like, oh, cool, lipstick. So I opened it, and I was like, whoa, that's like a really light shade of lipstick. But it glitters. And I really like it. As you can tell, I use it a lot. <laughs> I use it like every day that I put highlight on, just as a cream base. So I'm gonna put it there. take this brush from the Urban Decay Naked Illuminated palette and just kind of blend that in a little bit so that way I can make sure that I don't look like I'm just kind of like a triangle of highlighter right there because I've done that before and it looked so bad and I felt so embarrassed because people were like, why do you have like a block of highlighter on it was really strange, but I'm going to blend it down just a little bit. Okay, so now, since I normally use this brush, I'm going to just wipe it off real quick. Just to kind of get that blush off, because I already have the blush on, and I don't want to put even more on, if that makes sense, because then I'll just look like a I'm going to swirl it here. Oh yeah, this is the Urban Decay Naked Illuminated um, kind of palette, I guess you could say. It's a shimmering powder for face and body. So you can like wipe it all over your body if you're going to like some fancy dinner or something. But I really liked it. I mean, it's extremely, extremely shiny. So just rub it on there. Put it right on top of that cream base that we put that glow though. <laughs> kind of from that cream base stick. Yeah, yeah I think so. <laughs> okay, so I forgot to blend the other stuff out. Just a little bit. 
He's gonna be bigger here since I did it, but I don't want to do that. Oh, here it is. So then I just say a little bit more, I kind of put it there, but just a little bit on my nose, and then I take it in my nose, on my forehead, and then I'm gonna take it just a little bit on my finger, and then put it right there on my finger, kind of do it just a little bit of a shy. Okay, so that is the face. The face is done now. Um, so now, actually, the face is not done. <laughs> um, I'm going to put a little bit of the Naked Illuminated. So I'm going to take this. It's an e.l.f. brush. It's an e.l.f. professional eyeshadow brush. It's kind of flat. I really like it. I love it for um, the inner corner of my eyes which is what I'm using. So I'm going to take that Naked Illuminated and I'm going to put it up here in my eyes just to kind of, kind of make you look like you're waking up. You look, you look more awake since I've been working all day. I worked from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and it, I mean I love my job. Love it. But today was just hectic day. Now I'm going to be taking my Revlon Eyelash Curler. I don't know if you can find this one anymore. My mom gave it to me five plus years ago, so it's like really old, but it works really well. So I'm going to curl in my eyelash. Just hold it on there for a minute. Just don't make sure you don't poke your eyebrows out or your eye your eyeball out, because like I've done that before. Extremely bad. Okay, so now that that's curled, let's go ahead. Okay, so I'm going to be using two mascaras today. I'm going to be using the Tardius, the new Tarte um, mascara. Tardius looks like this upside down. It looks like that, and it's in black. I think it's in black, black. I think that's what it is. I know it's black. <laughs> and then I'm going to be using this Makeup Forever Professional Paris Excessive Lash Mascara. It looks like this. I'm subscribed to this um, Ipsy bag, and or Ipsy Glam bag, and I absolutely love it. I get so much stuff. This is the bag from this month, or last month, I think. Or maybe it's this month. I can't remember which month it is. But I love all the stuff that's in it. Like, it gives me so much stuff. And it's, like, new, upcoming, uh, like, makeup artists that have come up with, or come out with new makeup palettes and different things like that. But a lot of them are really nice. Like, I get um, Tarte Mascara all the time. And I got... This eyeshadow over here, it's Meet Me Matte, um, Tremani, but it's, it's like this little bitty, it's a little bitty, it's so cute, but, yeah. Where's my boyfriend? I can't tell if my boyfriend's here. I have to wait, but it's just this really beautiful, like, purpley, dark purple color. It's This lighting is not doing it justice whatsoever. It's so beautiful, but it's really nice. It's really nice. I really like it. So, yep, my boyfriend is here. He's texting me. Okay, so now with that makeup forever. I'm going to put that on my 
bottom lashes. Okay. Okay, I'll see you guys later.